Philippine, 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 Philippine Days Festival. Whoa. We're here in beautiful North Vancouver, British Columbia. Uh, Elvin, Elvin and his chipmunks. Fun loving people. What's going on? June 9th, Super Sunday, 2019. Center of the universe. Get down here, it's going off. We've got Kyla. Randy Santiago, another great Filipino international superstar. Come on down, there's amazing food, people, lots of uh, different booths here, different kinds of services. We got lots of the local politicians here. Wow, look at this energy we got. Zumba! Oh my goodness, it is going off. What a beautiful location for a festival. North Vancouver, right across from the downtown core. What's up, Maricor? From your placement agency. Um, and All of these young Filipinas there are getting ready for the parade that's about to begin. We have got beautiful people from around the Philippines, around the world here. Ronald Ukumu, happy birthday from Uganda, Africa. It is incredible, the energy. All right. Why are the Philippines so wonderful? What, what is it about them? Because of the people with the big heart. Yeah, the people are awesome. And the women are so beautiful, all of you. Oh my goodness, is that the legendary Sven Robinson himself? Hey, you guys, Justine Bell, Sven Robinson, what's up? What brings you to the Filipino Days Festival? Well, for me, it's the first time. The yeah. Okay. It's exciting. I'm, I'm running. I'm candidate. Burnaby North Seymour. What a beautiful dress. You look amazingly young and vibrant and healthy. Why were you getting back? Wow, what a great day today. Super Sunday. A lot of people encouraged me. They said, look, the issues on the environment, on human rights. Those issues are still front and center today. Oh, we got greatness in the house. Hey, Elvin. We have now the power to change. Well, Justine, you're a little bit different generation than Finn and I. You know, what are you hearing by the younger, the millennials out there and the younger generations? What's important to them today? The future. The future yeah. is important, and that's why climate change is number one. But when we're talking about housing, when we're talking about affordability and issues like transit, yeah, yeah. that's what I hear. Love God is in the house. Winnie Chan, ladies and gentlemen. Maganda, 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 maganda po kayo lahat. Eh, pagkakataon na ninyo kasi promotion po. Pumunta na po kayo doon sa TFC. Be able to join a team, Doug Meech Singh is our leader. Yeah. Great yeah. candidate for so Justine yeah. and serve my community. Yeah. Couldn't think of that anything. Nice to see those two parties, uh, NDP and Liberals, uh, represented here in the Filipino community. <laughs> well, I'll be honest, I don't speak Pino, so I have no idea what these guys are saying right now. Philippine Airlines, the Philippine Airlines has given po a round trip ticket wow. to Suri. Fun loving people. The Filipino community is so strong here in BC and in Vancouver. Opening ceremonies here. 
Filipino days. What I love about the Filipino culture is their spice for life. Nice, comfortable day. It's not too hot today. Perfect temperature. They have a real humbleness about them. They don't think they're anything special, but there's a lot of special uh, Filipino Canadians. There's Elvin, the man himself, getting ready for the big moment. He's combing his hair. He's looking slick. They celebrate family. They're very often very spiritual. They love basketball. And Elvin, we ready to get going here? How's it going? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that Big E TV fans in the house. All these gorgeous Filipinas here I see. Oh my goodness. Facebook Live with Mary Corferios, owner of Premium Placement Agency. How's it going, MJ? Hi. Filipino Canadians are some of the beautiful people in the world. Huh. Wow, yeah, it was quite uh, busy and happening. Everyone, welcome to the 2019 Philippine Days Festival. Hey. How are you enjoying yourself, Filipino hey. Festival, so far? Hey. Yeah, a lot of Filipino food. What's your favorite? Adobo. Adobo. Adobo? You like adobo? Oh, okay. I like the pork As the we learn a lot from you about family and about spirituality, about basketball. What do you learn about Canadians? Our president. Our All right. president. You don't like hockey. I don't like hockey either, but you like basketball. Yeah, am I not mistaken? All right. Let's go, you guys. This is Ray and Gene. All right. Go Raptors. Our director, Robert Tompoy. You look beautiful. I like how you're all decked out there. Pinoy style. Okay. Our member of Parliament for the Honorable MP, Jonathan Wilkinson. Wow, what a bunch of friendly people here. Wow. Of the Filipino Canadian community. Let's just take a look and see what some of the vendors are. Your small business might want to be a part of Filipino Days Festival here in North Vancouver. RCMP's finest here. So are you a Filipino Canadian RCMP? And so what's your story, Chris? It was something I always wanted to do. Opportunities is, is always good in the in the forest, so that's why I took it like my really? <laughs> well, you seem like such a nice guy, though. I'm not a type of person to look for fight. Yeah. I can talk my way out of all right. situations. Fun loving people. It works way better when, when you can just talk things out. Yeah. 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 <laughs> what does it mean to you representing the Filipino Canadian community in the form of such a grandiose way? It's good. It's, it's who I am. Well, great to meet you, Chris. And uh, carry on the good work, man. Right, thank you. You represent yourself well. All right, thank you. Thank you. That's what I do, folks. I connect with people. Holy cow, it's crazy. This is for you all. Let's just have some fun. Hi, I'm Jonathan. I'm here with Stembert College. We're a healthcare post-secondary institution and we yeah. help nurses from other countries become nurses in Canada. Ooh. And how do you do that? We have a roadmap that we uh, we follow, but uh, we are also offering a free $10,000 program for anyone who's wi willing to be a HCA, healthcare assistant here in Canada. No way. Yeah, wow. sponsored by Covida. please come forward. So how would somebody sign up for you if they wanted to take on your service? Oh, you can go on our website or you can sign up here at the Filipino Festival www.stembercollege.com Awesome! It's a really interesting program. $10,000 for a free education if you uh, enroll as part of their program. I don't know! I don't know! I'm thinking about it! We would like to thank people who are taking videos and pictures of everybody and with all the photographers. Thank you so much. Oh, there we 
go, there's Jethro Sequinto. Jethro and Jethro Films over here. Hey, hey, hey. Just there. went from the flag ceremony. Jethro, look at those shots, man. Oh my goodness. Tell me a little bit about your music. You get ridiculous hits on YouTube. Well, I'm not really into music right now. Yeah, you're yeah. doing more production stuff? Exactly, yeah. Philippine Days Festival in beautiful North Vancouver, British Columbia. Collectively, as a Canadians, we are richer by having the Filipino culture as part of our traditions here in our land. I'm working, but I don't mind it. If this is work, I don't mind working because this is friggin' awesome. All right, gals, what's going on? What kind of music do you like? Rock, baby, we rock. What a great song. Wow. Do you like the rockers? I don't want to. Do you call yourself Filipino Canadian? We have Andy Santiago and Kyla, some of the biggest stars from the Philippines, right here, 2019. Let's check it out. Oh my. Facebook Live, <laughs> Philippines. Hey, okay, right. Kyla is going off here. Let's check it out. Kyla, coming down. Well, Kyla is a huge star in the Philippines, a huge singer. for bringing us here more Filipino action right here. Don't touch that dial. Free concert going off here. Let's check it out, Randy Santiago. people here. Elvin, thank you so much for having Big E TV involved with the uh, Philippine Days. Wow. And I saw Sven Robinson. How cool is that? Woo! 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 But I'm gonna try to have a conversation that's a little bit bigger than ourselves. Are you a Raptors fan? Oh, Lakers fan. Boo! No Lakers fan. Uh, All right, you guys. Let's go interview some of the vendors here. So, getting paid is mandatory. Combined insurance. All right. Let's check out these guys. Hey, sir. You want to get on Big E TV? Go Facebook Live? Okay, these guys don't want to be on Facebook Live. Can't give up. You got to just keep trying. Net City, how are you guys? Do you want to go Facebook Live and get on Big E TV and talk about what you're doing? No. Oh my goodness, it's one, two, three strikes. You're out. Okay, Urban Deca Home Manila. 
Would you guys like to go to Facebook Live and talk about what you're doing? <laughs> Nobody? I'm going Facebook Live. I was wondering, would you guys like to get on camera and talk about what you're doing here? Carly, Eric. I met you yesterday, I think, Carly. Julia, Eric. Marley, can you read your message there? Love and happiness. Love and courage. Love and courage. For North Vancouver. What does that mean to you? What does that mean to you? Well, it's uh, sort of, again, from a Jack Lake quote. So, hope over fear. Love. Yeah, love is better than anger. We are putting it together here, folks. With love and courage and optimism, we can change the world. Change the world. Change the world. Wow. Well, you know, we got we got The love is really a, about our oneness, right? When yeah. we're talking about land, when we're talking about people, yeah. all of it. And then we have to have courage to stand up and make sure that that love shines right. So love and courage, what does that mean to you? It means hope and optimism for a society that works for everyone. Where yeah. no one gets left behind and everyone can strive to their full potential. What does love mean to you? It means if I give out love and courage, I will receive love. Yeah. We work together and lift each other up. We can help somebody up so we can all rise. Awesome. Okay. I love that message, all right. Thank you so much, Justine. Right on. Thanks, lady. We gotta change this. We gotta change this. We gotta change this. Put down the whole row there. No, thank you. No, thank you. I don't want to do Big ETV. No, thank you. No, thank you. And then who are the ones? A bunch of nice ladies there. <laughs> Thank you so much. All right, love you guys. Fun loving people.